Hi there, so originally I was planning to do a lot more of these videos after graduating, but after getting a job I got very busy and only now that we're in the middle of a pandemic I decided to find some time to do another one of these. And just to give this video a little bit of background, about a year ago, just before graduating, I started doing these videos. I wanted to do them every month originally, just to see, kind of, just to record what I'm gonna do, what I'm doing. Uh, but then when I got a job, I underestimated how much there is to learn, how busy I'm going to be, so eventually I stopped. And I deleted most of those videos, there's still one left that I did in college, and yeah. So now I decided to find some time to do it again and I'm working as a software engineer for almost a year now and at the moment like many people I'm working from home so there isn't actually much to do except for work, sports and that's it. At 10 a.m. we have a meeting with the team to talk about progress and what people are working on and so on, if people need help and stuff. And at about 10, 30 or 11, I usually have a quick coffee or breakfast for about 15 minutes. And today at one o'clock we had this session where we were shown and explained how to use our own software that we're building because the software is for artists, we are developers and it's kind of, well it's good to know how it's actually used. And it's actually very informative, I wish we had more of these because as you can imagine as a developer I can come up with some simple use case for this tool but artists they're professionals and this is built for them so they actually know exactly how to use it. Yeah, so that was fun, and so the rest of the day was pretty much a mix of meetings and writing code. And today I finished up at 5 because it was such a good weather outside and I decided to go for a run. I ended up running just over 17 kilometers with this huge blister on the bottom of my foot which is like not going away for weeks but I have this plan with my friend to do a half marathon in a week so I'm just trying to keep training for it. Um, yeah maybe 17 is a little bit too much for a half marathon training but whatever it's it, it keeps me busy when there is no other sports to do and yeah just to end this on a software engineering kind of related note I went back to going through this refactoring book, which I don't do every single day, but I'm kind of slowly working through it. The book was given to me by my manager uh, shortly after I joined the company, and it kind of gives you an idea of how what clean code looks like and how you can actually clean up the code if it's already messy. It's a really good read. I am just over like halfway through, but it's a it's a book that you kind of you might jump around when you're reading it. And after college, probably the main three ways I'm keeping myself kind of educated outside of actually learning from my coworkers is books. Sometimes they're PDFs, sometimes they're hardbacks like this. Then I do these like LinkedIn courses, like or Udemy courses or whatever. You can find a bunch of them. And the last one is, of course, just documentation and Stack Overflow. All right, that's it for this one. I wish everyone a safe lockdown. 
and thanks very much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.